Thank you for joining us on this week's Puma Presser. I'm standing alongside head baseball coach Rick Odette. Coach Odette, as you prepare for the season in the spring, what are you doing right now in the fall to get ready? Well, the first two weeks we started with individual work. So we brought guys in, bullpens, ground balls, uh, batting cage type stuff, uh, things to do kind of to really work on before we really get going into practice, which started this past Monday. So do you have any uh, inner squads, scrimmages, fall ball games, things like that over the fall? And what are you looking for in those games uh, from your players? Well, we'll inner squad pretty much all fall, uh, you know, probably a couple times a week. We also have three outside scrimmages this fall. Uh, you know, a lot of it is just getting guys on the field, see how they compete. Um, you know, really what we have, you know, we, we think we have a lot of talent. It's just a matter of how they're going to interact and, you know, how they'll play really. Roughly 80% of your innings pitched is back this year. Uh, a number of your hitters return this year. Any higher expectations than in years past? I know expectations are always high with Puma baseball, but there's something in terms of progressive after a 26 and 24 season? Yes, I mean, you know, on paper it's good. Mm -hmm. You know, and, and we talked about that with our team is on paper and talent-wise we feel comfortable, but there's a lot that has to go into it. You know, if we want to win at the level that, that we should uh, and we expect to, there's a lot of things on a day-to-day -day basis that, you know, we have to keep getting better at. And I think the biggest thing for us is to see how we'll compete this fall. And, you know, we've got a, we've got a lot of positions open. Uh, to be honest, all of them are open. We, we need to be better than we were a year ago, uh, but we feel pretty good with the talent we have right now. Speaking of the talent, I know over the summer a lot of guys play over the summer in, in preparation to get ready for fall. Has anybody really impressed you with a good summer leading into the fall? We had a number of great summers, actually. Kevin Ford was an, was an all-star. Uh, Kyle Matter was a really good player. Uh, Riley Benner, uh, who played here in Lafayette uh, not too far down the road. Uh, they had great summers. Our incoming guys uh, really worked throughout the summer. I mean, the, the great thing now with all these summer leagues, they're able to get around other good players, uh, and I think kind of to, to hopefully soak some of that in and see if they can bring that to, to our program for sure. But, yeah, we, we were really excited about it. I think guys had great summers that overall. Guys came back in shape, uh, which is key, and so now hopefully we can build on that. As the pitching coach on the staff as well, what are you looking for your pitchers, or what are you trying to teach them as they come in and get ready for the season? Well, I think in, a, in an era that velocity is such a big deal, we're, we're trying to get guys to understand how to make their own adjustments. Uh, you know, when they're on the mound, to be able to adjust pitch to pitch uh, and really get fundamental to where they, they understand their mechanics, not just trying to throw as hard as they can, uh, and, and really be able to, to, to throw consistent strikes, but throw quality strikes, get it to both sides of the plate, uh, be able to repeat off-speed pitches, and so on. So there's a lot of that, uh, more, which is way more important than just worrying about how hard they're going to throw on a radar gun. So we're trying to incorporate that and hopefully by the end of the fall uh, you know going into our winter workouts we can get them with a really good base and then build from there coach Odette thank you for joining us on this week's boom presser thanks for having me